Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will troubleshoot the issue. Bluetooth is connected, but there is no voice on your connected device. Okay, so how to troubleshoot this issue? First, go to Bluetooth and other devices setting. Go to search bar, then type here Bluetooth and other devices setting. Click on it. And you can follow these steps in all the windows, Windows 10, 11, 8, 7 as well. Okay, it is taking more time. We can open from here as well. Once you are on a, this page, you need to click on that device, which is connected, but there is no voice. Okay, let's say it is connected now. Just remove this device once. Okay, you need to remove this device once and then try. If uh, after reconnecting still persists the issue, go to services. Just you need to go to search bar then type here services and you will see this result. Run it as an administrator. Okay, open it and then look for Bluetooth support service as well as the other services like Bluetooth audio gateway. Just stop it once. Again, Bluetooth support service, stop this as well. Yes. Okay, both service you need to stop and then start it one by one. What this method will do, this method will refresh all the settings and restart it once. And like this, restart it once again. And once the restart is done, check if your, your issue is solved or not. If the issue is still persist, go to device manager to check our devices setting as well as the driver. Click on device manager option and look for Bluetooth service here. And this is the Bluetooth option. Okay. Go to the connected device like if I collected with Dell 1 update driver. Make sure you are connected with the network search automatically and this is the main driver wireless this option update this as well and you can update all the drivers one by one this is good for you and your computer okay so this is the second method you can try it out another thing you can do on the device manager you can uninstall the device or disable it once click on yes and re-enable it once. Now it is enabled now. Okay. So this is the other method. So we have disable and re-enable it. If still there is an issue, you need to right click on that and click on uninstall device and do not check this box. Just uninstall it and restart your system. Once the restart is done, your issue will be fixed. If after the restart you don't get your Bluetooth option here, just go to Google and then type Intel Bluetooth driver for Windows 10. Okay, this option and Bluetooth driver for 64 bit download it. I have already downloaded it. So let me go to the download option. And you can also choose for Windows 7, 11. This driver is for 11 as well. This is the Bluetooth driver I have downloaded. Okay. You just need to double click on it and how to run it. I will show you. Click on yes button when the prompt opens. Okay. Now already the driver is there. So I'm clicking on yes. Click on next and it is installing. Next. Choose here the complete option you will be getting there that option also I have already downloaded since that's why I'm getting this remove option so click on complete option and then restart your system and your issue will be fixed so hope your issue is fixed now if your issue is fixed then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching